Well, the Bay Area has a rich maritime past. Its links to the days of sailors and tall wooden ships continue even today. NBC Bay Area's Joe Rosado Jr. shows us one group that thinks that's something to sing about. San Francisco is a city built with ships. Their masts once filled the harbors like a thick forest. Vestiges of that maritime past are tethered to the docks of the Hyde Street Pier like floating museum pieces. The Balcutha and the Eureka offer a glimpse of what life at sea once looked like. But on the first Saturday night of every month, welcome to our monthly shanty sing, comes more of what shipboard life might have sounded like. Grab onto a chorus when you can and sing along. The girls on the shore will never forget and we're bound for the Rio Grande. Well, the shanty sing has been going on steadily since 1981. And we're bound for the Rio Grande. Each month, visitors gather below the deck of one of the historic ships to sing history to life. When I was a boy and I had met Sally, we're aboard an 1890 San Francisco Bay ferry boat called the Eureka. Shellbacks and farmers just the same. The National Park Service has hosted this monthly sea shanty sing-along for more than 35 years. Oh, Pedro, the crimp boys, we know him all bold. Oh, roll. Shanty is a work song that coordinates the effort of doing jobs together aboard a ship. In this case, there are no sails to raise or anchors to hoist. Admission is free, and anyone is free to sing. He's got a shanty. I've always liked sailing, and uh, you know, I, I always wanted to run away to sea. This is about as close as I'm going to get, probably. People come in, and uh, some are afraid to sing. Some are geared up to sing, and they've been waiting all month with their paper very well worn and tightly grasped in their white knuckles. The age-old songs are handed down through books, recordings, and these days by YouTube. It doesn't matter if you think you can sing or not. Think about it, the sailors were not recruited out of the opera houses ashore. You know, the choruses are usually short, repetitive, some of them are just like, hey, hey, ho. Hoorah, hoorah, for the gals of the town. What it does is preserve our history through song. A lot of people are just not used to actually singing like that, unless it's in the shower. Well, I think it's very magical at night. Stars, the lights of the city. Ships, they, when we're aboard them, they somehow come alive. For at least a few hours every month, again, these old ships once again fill with life. A voyage into the past on sails filled with the winds of song. Joe Rosado Jr., NBC Bay Area News. I like the part where you don't have to have a good voice to sing. That would be yes. me. I'm I, in. I may join them. <laughs> right me now, three. checking in with Chief Meteorologist. <laughs>